My name is George Sugiyama. I'm 88 years old. Back in the late 1940s, I had dropped out of school and uh, my dad was very disappointed, but he also needed some help with an apple orchard that he had just bought. And this was in Vernon, in the Okanagan, and that's where I met my wife. As you probably know, we were all evacuated from the coast area. Uh, I feel like I lost all my friends. We had to leave them all behind, and uh, uh, whatever new friends we made were usually really good friends. My wife had a really good friend, and her name was Heather, and she kept that name, and 20 years later, she named our daughter after her. I guess I always wanted to be a dentist, and uh, in 1948, when I was in just getting into university, that was when all the veterans were going through university too. We had to compete with them, and if, unless you were really smart, you you weren't able to compete. And this is one of the reasons why I dropped out. I dropped out for. 10 years. During that time I had, I worked for my dad, I worked for a dry ice plant here in Vancouver for a dollar and a half an hour. That was great wages for me after working on the orchard. Dollar and a half an hour, double time for overtime. Well, like I said, I, I spent 10 years out of school doing things that I really didn't want to do. I did quite well in the first year. Out of a class of over 100, I was uh, ranked fifth, which was I thought was fantastic. Well, like in the middle of dentistry, you, you can't give up. <laughs> you had to go forward. There was no two ways about it. I think in, education is so important. You should keep learning for the rest of your life, pick up things. I think you can learn a lot from seniors too, just by talking to them. You can you can also humor them if you don't don't believe them. <laughs>